All right, we're here with Alana Huggins. Uh, Alana, you're training to uh, hopefully compete in the 2012 uh, Olympics, correct? Right. And uh, this will be the first year that they'll allow women to compete. Uh, but how long have you actually been boxing? Uh, I've been fighting uh, 13 years. And so what initially got you into uh, the sport of boxing? It's usually I, a male-dominated sport. I was I was a pudgy kid. Like, I was kind of, I was pretty overweight most of my life. And uh, when I started high school, you know, it's a brutal time for a girl. So I wanted to do something to, you know, make me tougher and uh, just really kind of give me an edge going into high school. Uh, I just wanted to lose some weight mostly, and that really helped. Um, and I knew that that was an intense workout, so I begged my dad to let me do it. And so you actually took a, a hiatus from the sport. Yeah, four years. Um, and what, what was the reason behind that? Um, I lost to the same girl that I had lost to um, twice in a row. And uh, I had told myself before I went, if I lost to her again, that it was a sign that give it up, let it go. And um, I felt like I got robbed. You know, she scored like 16 points at nationals, which in Olympic style scoring is unheard of. So I felt really really like I was I was robbed of that fight because I was ahead going into the fourth round uh, by by more than two points and for her to come back like that with that margin I just I couldn't believe it it broke my heart it was a case of being heartbroken and so then I guess why come back I mean what what prompted you to actually pick up the gloves again when I found out they were gonna let us fight in the Olympics for the first time since 1902 uh, and my weight class was one of them. I just thought, this is a sign. I've got to go back. And I was pretty good. You know, I, I won quite a few tournaments in the Pan Am. So I think I got a good shot. And so uh, where are you currently training out of right now? I train with Reyes Boxing Club over in Fort Worth. Okay. And uh, how has that how has that team helped prepare you uh, on the on the comeback? Right? Um, I've, I box with uh, Tony Cabello, Vince Reyes, uh, Paul Reyes, and Ralph Casillas. And um, as a team, I could not have a better team behind me because I have they all kick my butt and uh, they push me to a, to my limit and way past it. And I feel like I've gotten further in these past two months than I could have on on my own, you know, or with anybody else. All right. Well, that's all we really want to, to speak with you uh, about. And, you know, best of luck Thank you. Uh, on your on your journey to the Olympics. <laughs> okay. And uh, any shout outs to any uh, anyone else besides your team or my mom and dad and chap. Um, Chappie's sick right now and uh, I wish him the best of luck getting better. I love you.